So hey you guys, I'm back and today I have something that you all have been waiting for. Today I decided to film a video of me trying on these um, Salatica Hydrocore Rio Collection contact lenses. So the lenses I chose today were, like I said, the Salatica Hydrocore Rio Buzios. Buzios, Buzios, I'm really not sure how you pronounce that, but that is what I chose. So, um, as usual, I always get my contact lenses with a prescription inside, which I will explain later in this video. But in case you don't want to sit through the video that long, because I do have the contact lenses in, but if you would like to see me actually put them in and see my natural eye color and see them in natural lighting, which I will include in this video, then you can keep watching. But if you're one of those people with the short attention span like I am, I'll give you the specs real quick. So like I said, I got these Salatica Hydrocore Rio Buzio contacts and I ordered them off of Lens.me. So Lens.me is a website that a lot of you guys suggested in my comments um, since I've been doing contact reviews because I've always fussed about how long it takes for my contacts to get to me or high shipping. So at these, the shipping didn't cost, I don't even think I had shipping fees, if not it was probably like something like $6. But anyway, um, the contact lenses are prescribed, I'm not going to tell you what, but I do know that these contact lenses were not in a warehouse because these contact lenses were actually produced today and I will post the picture. So they were produced on April 27, 2018 and it says that they expire on April the 26th, 2023. So these are some pretty fresh contacts. The diameter of these contacts are 14.2 and the base curve is 8.7. So, like any Salatica contacts, these contacts are very comfortable. Like, Salatica has never given me a problem with their contacts at all. And to me, Salatica really looks very realistic. I mean, as realistic as you're going to get with contact lenses anyways. And since they're hydrocore, they don't have the lumbar ring, which is the outer ring that circles your iris. Or whatever. You know, when they, <laughs> let me stop saying whatever. You know, the dark black rings or the teal rings or whatever that they like to put around the iris of the contacts to make them look realistic, but it doesn't look too realistic to me. So I'm just gonna grab the specs on these contacts so I can give you the price and everything on them. Be right back. So I just found the receipt on my contact lenses. Um, like I said, I purchased them from Lens.me and they have really great shipping. So whenever you order contact lenses from Lens.me, you get them in three days, y'all. So I literally got these contacts in three days and it was called Express Shipping. And looking at my receipt, I actually didn't pay for shipping and handling, it was zero dollars. So that is a plus. However. Salatica so contacts are really expensive. Like when I say expensive, they are really expensive. So the contacts were $49.50 for one contact. And the pair together was $99. Now I do know there was a sale going on. And I think if you were to get another pair, you could get them for $89 or a little bit cheaper or something like that going on. Don't quote me because I might be wrong. I, I really might be wrong. <laughs> But yeah, I paid $99 for these contacts, so uh, if you don't see a contact review in a while, that is why. Because these things are expensive. So yes, um, on the website, these contacts are described as a green color. So on the website, it describes the Rio Buzios as a green and it, on the website it says, green is always described as the color of envy and your friends and social media followers will certainly be jealous when they see you wearing Salatica Hydrocore Rio and Buzios. A stunning shade of green with hints of lime. You'll feel as if you're deep in the Brazilian jungle. No matter what tone your night your eyes radiate, you can wear Hydrocore Rio Buzios as it complements any shade with ease. Um, be sure to pick up the new release from Salatica, available only at Lens.me. So it describes these contact lenses as a green shade with a hint of lime. Um, ba -ba -da -ba. um, it also says that. Oh. Um, this is a monotone shade. 
so I guess with all the greens they didn't go and add any brown to the um, contact so it's just straight green they want the contact to be green so it's straight green so <laughs> green lime green and um, so I'm just gonna read to you what this says it says if you're concerned that these might make your eyes seem dull their effect is just the opposite and I found out with Salaka contacts it says specks of lime green are seamlessly blended throughout the lens to ensure a multi-dimensional look that adds sparkle and shine now I don't think I've seen all of that in these contact lenses but it does say both the men and women can benefit from the boost of color found in hydrochloral buzios and it can easily take your look from good to great so um I don't know if I've seen all of that in these contact lenses but they are some really pretty contact lenses they're really pretty and they really do show up as a true green color even in my eyes and I have dark brown eyes which you will see if you continue watching so yeah so I guess getting up really close I kind of can see um, the lime green It's like right in between all the other dark green <laughs> shades all the other dark green shades so um if you stare really hard at these contacts you will see the lime green and the contacts and i think that does make them very dimensional multi-dimensional whatever the description wants to say about them but um yeah right now i actually think these are my favorite my <laughs> my favorite shade from the salatica uh, collection of contacts that I own. I don't have all of the Rio contacts. I plan on trying the rest of the Rios, but I'm not sure money-wise how that will go. So, um, if you're interested in seeing me actually try on these contact lenses and you want to see the packaging it came out of and you know the box that they sent in the mail, then please keep watching. Hey y'all, so I'm back and I want to show y'all the packaging that the contact lenses came in and also I want to come to you with no makeup on whatsoever so um, you can see how they look if you're the type of person that doesn't wear makeup because whether you believe it or not, makeup makes or breaks contact lenses and sometimes you need makeup to make some lenses look better than others or to make them look a little more realistic than how they look if you don't have on makeup because something about eyelashes and eyeliner I don't know it's something about it but it makes a huge difference so y'all um I ordered the lenses from lens.me and since it's a white box I'm pretty sure it just messed up the coloring of my video but anyway I bought it from lens.me and um it's kind of cool like the box that it came in I'm gonna mess up the light again this is the box and then when you open it it came like this so it has this little freaking card with little googly eyes and they wrote me a and they wrote me a specialized note that says hi Jaleesa thanks for your trust um, let your eyes sparkle when you smile and someone signed it it looks like it says Fessa or Fisa I don't know but somebody signed it but yeah so like in the little package there's this envelope that the contact lenses come out of so I thought that was pretty neat how they packaged everything up to make sure the contact lenses don't slide around and bang around the box and all that good stuff so yeah so the lenses I bought were the Hydro the Solotica so the lenses I got are from Solotica and they are the Hydrocore Rio Buzios if I'm pronouncing that right because it might be wrong so I haven't opened this box at all because I've been trying to save it for this video but of course I got my I'm going to show y'all a picture of well I'm going to put a picture up of this but I got my contact lenses in a prescription because I can't see without a prescription in my eyes so don't laugh at the power actually I might bleep it out but yeah I got them with a prescription and the diameter of the contacts is 14.2 and the base curve is 8.7 so one thing that I thought was neat on these boxes, how I know I have a fresh batch of contact lenses versus the ones from my old videos. I believe someone mentioned in my comments that the, that the contact lenses from Salatica that I had been reviewing back in the day were from a wholesale place or something like that. So these are not from a place like that. These are fresh contacts because the box actually has the 
expiration date on them. It comes in the box and my other contacts did not come in the box. And it has when they were manufactured. So these were manufactured on April the 27th, 2018 this year. And they expire April 26, 2023. So, yeah. <clears throat> so when you open the box, it's gonna be out of focus. You open the box, it has some wording, important information for your eyes. I'll take a picture of this. And the box is pretty cute. I like the coloring. And inside, you basically have a contact case and your two vials with the lenses inside. But anyways, like I was saying, my, my um, battery died. It came with the two vials with the contacts and as well as a contact case. And right now I'm just going to open up the vials and put them in the case and let them soak for a little while. I actually just cut myself. So be careful. So now getting up close, I'm gonna show you what a contact looks like in one eye versus the other. In my, you know, my natural colored eyes. So. And now I'm gonna put the other contact in my other eye. So these are the contacts up close and they do come off with that green color and since they look pretty natural, as natural as contacts are going to get. Here are the contacts in natural lighting. I actually like them more in natural lighting than I do with the artificial lights. Um, Solotica is still my favorite contact lens brand to wear. And as you can see, they are really showing up truly green, truly. Because these lenses are hydrocore, they don't have the limbal ring, so it tries to make them look a little bit more natural. But yeah, hydrocore usually do not have a limbal ring. And the limbal ring is basically the little darkened circle around the, the iris. But yeah. So you guys, I hope you enjoyed my video. And if I did leave out any details that you wanted to know about these contact lenses, please be sure to leave your questions and concerns in the comment section below. Um, whenever you leave comments, I do try my best to give you an answer if I can or you know, try to get back to you on the quickest time that I can with my comments. But like I say, if you have any concerns, any questions about these contests, then please leave it in the description below. And again, thank you all for watching this video. I will be back for more, so keep watching. And I'll see you on my next video. Bye.